So little Gemma is like Duncan's best buddy and listen to what she calls him. What do you say Duncan? Say Dunky. Dunky. Say Dunky? <laughs> it's like the cutest thing. Dunky. Dunky. everyone we have some extra special fun friends here with us today the wife's life came over and they spent the night this is the second night in a row and look at what they are doing right now what well, it's taking caca oh <laughs> a donut it's a donut and we're gonna put sprinkles donut in. donut i want a donut in my tummy hey okay. put an apple like here it's then in put in like a way. pizza here <laughs> he eats so much that some has to be on top of his stomach. Delicious. He eats so much. <laughs> Love that. What color do you want your sprinkles? Uh, uh, rainbow. Parker, what's your face? My face says the Incredibles. It's really good. I like the to incredible me, symbol and then the mask. To me, it's like a clown nose, tiger stripes, and like. Do you see it? Did you notice his lips are not that red? Cause it, cause we put the thing on him. What thing did you put on him? Does anybody else have any paint on them? Uh, I washed mine off cause Ooh. Bailey's gonna do something to me. Ours can be faces. Cause. <laughs> cause you don't want to mess with all this beauty? Put some sprinkles on it with like glitter. So. Yeah! <laughs> Their oldest sister Gabrielle happens to have the exact same birthday as Jacob and both her and Jacob really wanted to go to the Great Wolf Lodge for their birthday so we had like a big birthday extravaganza at Great Wolf Lodge. You can see that video it's already posted it's like Jacob's birthday special. Gemma's in her baby like zone. Hey what are you saying little girl? Oh you're like an angel. Are you okay in there? Are you done with your nap or are you just taking your nap? I should figure that out. Let me see if I just interrupted nap time or if she's done napping. I don't know what happened. Was Gemma supposed to be napping? Yeah. I think Gretchen went in there and rattled her cage. Did she, did she fall asleep at one point? Let's not call no, it a not cage. Yet. It's a play yard. A her cage play yard. Rattled the play yard. It's not a cage. So we, we lovingly call it a cage. It's not a cage. I don't know. It's an arena. It's a container. It's like a field. funny parenting term, guys. It's a, it's we look. You're just containing your child within a safe area. That's yeah. all you do. It's a baby item. Like you're buying it for a baby for safety, yeah, but it's also not, it's fun to call it a cage. It's so. not barbed or anything. It's not electric. <laughs> you know, I mean, it's safe. That's the whole point. So. It's the point. It's, and, a, it's a fence. Yeah. Perimeter. We'll call and, it a perimeter. What are you guys setting up over here? Little Catan. Settlers of Catan. One of the best Euro games out there, especially Starter. How, so, how many Euro games have you played to, to be able to be um, able to say that? Many, I would say maybe just maybe 20 to 30. But oh. the thing about this is it's well balanced. It's not too complicated. And you can really learn on the fly in your first game, would you say, if someone's kind of teaching you? What do you think, Chris? Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna let the kids do some more of their painting and <laughs> we'll see how that turns out. I think it washes off or it could be, I don't know. It, could, <laughs> it could ruin all of our outdoor furniture, but hopefully not. <laughs> It'll be worth it because we'll be getting to play Settlers Catan and also pokey adults won't accidentally wake up Gemma. And Duncan is actually upstairs in his crib napping. It looks like, it looks like right now they are painting Parker's chest. Were they doing that before? <laughs> yeah, they're putting food Literally, it, it, on looked, his belly. it looked like they were holding him down, but I think he's doing it willingly. Yes. Okay. So a little bit of, of like an excuse at first. Everybody just woke up, and we've been having a super slumber party for two days. So no, everything's not going to look perfect. This isn't like an Instagram home of beauty. But I want to show you our setup because it's been a really fun time, and it's okay that it's not perfect. So be okay with that. Jeff and Melissa have been staying in our like tall blow-up bed in our office. Oh, ba ba ba. Gemma's been right next to them in her plate crib that they bring from from their life. And I'm gonna go kind of quietly because Duncan's asleep in his bed. Duncan's asleep in his room, but the boys, Parker and Jacob, have been using their little blow up mats that we use for camping. And they've been sleeping in his bedroom. And then two of the girls, I don't know which, I think, I think it's Gwyneth and Graceland have been in Bailey's bedroom in a blow up mattress. Bailey and then the two sisters. And then Gretchen and Gabrielle have been in Jacob and Parker's bunk bed, which I know you guys haven't seen yet. Because but. we're still working on a room makeover video with Wendy. So this isn't complete, but you'll see like they've had bunk beds for a while. 
and here it is. And it's been wonderful. It totally worked to have a bonus, what is it, seven people staying at our house for a couple days. It's been really fun. Okay, but let me just tell you the tea. <laughs> I did not know my kids were ready for like crushes and all that like that wasn't a thing that had been happening <laughs> It happened so fast because all of a sudden Gwyneth and Jacob come down in like the fanciest clothes Jacob's got his hair done. Jacob actually came up to me and it was so sweet because he was like mommy Can I pay to have a movie? We'll do a movie night and um, can I pay for it? And I was like what is going on and in my head we were already gonna do a movie night that night and I was just like okay like where is this headed what's going on and he was like because I'm gonna take Gwyneth on a date <laughs> what what <laughs> my baby and he was doing it so cute so I was like okay like and Gretchen ran up and she's like they're going on a date and we're all gonna go and like the date was Jacob and Gwyneth sitting in first class which meant the front row where the movie was, then all the other kids were around them and they watched a movie. So yes, that happened. Jacob, you guys, Jacob, my precious baby Jacob. Right, you guys have any updates for us? Yes. We drew a witch, a poop, and some scratches. And, and he got some armpit hairs. Oh, growing up. <laughs> Is that? <laughs> <laughs> and scars. Yeah. Oh. You got the little arm in there. Witch. Love that. <laughs> this looks amazing. Parker, do you like it? Yeah. Can you do a some? Mustache. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> mustache. Bumble yes. <laughs> what is that? Bumble yes. What is that? Oh, oh. Uh, that. The weird mom person. And it's it's thing. it's the baby from Incredibles. I want to wipe that Michelle. Don't touch me. Ooh, don't touch me. So, mm -mm. so Jacob drew that. Really fancy. Two, really really good. two scoops. Oh, two oh. scoops. I love that. <laughs> so I just went up and got a little vlog of the girls and uh, Jacob playing basketball and when I came back down through I went through the same spider web that Chris went through yesterday but I think the spider rebuilt it like twice as gross so <laughs> I have to go make sure I don't have any What's gross? I got and this and this is Jeff or oh, you yeah. can refer to him as Daddy Weiss in the well, comments. Nobody calls him that. <laughs> Everybody Literally calls him that. It's so weird. That. He keeps insisting that we all call yeah. him Daddy Weiss. <laughs> so. Look, see, she yeah. calls him Daddy Weiss. Yeah, so little Gemma is like Duncan's best buddy. And listen to what she calls him. Why do you say Duncan? Say hey, Dunky. Hey, Dunky. <laughs> it's like the cutest thing. So yeah, she's already taken to calling him Dunky. It's very, very, very cute. The shading on this cookie is remarkable. It's beautiful, isn't it? And poop. It looks, it looks like a real cookie. Star, star, star. I don't know. He's the armpit hair. Star. I the hair. Yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> nobody <laughs> expects the armpit hair. I did my face. I tried. You look beautiful, sweetie. Wow, oh, you did a great job, Gwen. Thanks. Since there was no, like, there was no light, 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 so I used gold. That's beautiful. Good idea. Okay, so I'm going to show you my, like, really happiness moment of the day. I am a big fan of LaCroix water, which I think, I think you guys know at this point. My favorite is the Nicola, which is, like, Cola LaCroix. Um, I love it so much. If you drink Coca-Cola or Pepsi or any of that, now you're not going to like it. I'm warning you now. I don't drink soda, so for me, it's like a shock to my senses. It's delicious. It is so hard to get. I have only found it at Whole Foods, and even then, it goes out of stock like all the time. But today, I got six cases. Ah, they like had a huge shipment coming to Whole Foods, so I'm so happy. I haven't had this for two months. My gosh, let's look right. Let's see, I wanna know. So it smells like soda. Yeah, because it, yeah. Wow, dramatic much? <laughs> so it definitely has a soda essence. Cola. I mean, it doesn't taste like soda, but it smells like it. 
It smells when like I had it my first time, I was like, how is this even possible? What are they doing? What kind of chemical poison is in this like to make this happen? And the ingredients still look pretty cool, you guys. So yeah. I don't even know, I don't understand yeah. it. To me, I thought it was a miracle of science, which it is. Only carbonated water and natural essence. Man, How I they get what magic is in this essence? I don't know. I'm I'm gonna be cool about essence. I'm gonna just embrace the essence because I love it so much. <laughs> Seriously, I've shared this with so many people, and most of them aren't impressed. Okay, I admit, it is weird, but I love it. That it says naturally essenced, like, but it doesn't specify with what. Secret I know. Ingredients. I'm pretty sure it's probably with beaver anal gland. What? <laughs> What are you talking about, beaver, <laughs> anal, what? So I am a pescatarian, which, and at one point in my life, for a long time, I was a very serious vegetarian. And there are lots of foods that are flavored with feet of me. Why would there be anal gland essence. essence in my water? There just isn't other things. So like, I get suspicious when it's like this good. I'm what? like, that's beaver butt. It right? Good. Don't you say that about I don't the beaver know. butt? I don't know. Is that I a common know. response? I didn't know it was a thing, but I'm never eating anything again that says it just has essence, if that's the case, and I don't know what's It's actually it. raspberry flavoring. Oh, yeah. Raspberry like flavoring? Like if you have candies is... or ice creams with raspberry flavoring, it's typically beaver butt. I don't even like raspberries. We're never eating it again. Welcome to another episode of Jessica Ruins Food for People. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so we are just over here innocently playing Catan, right? Yes, here we are. Yes, playing, swing. Except for Melissa, she's playing it like a vixen. <laughs> but anyway, we looked out the window and Jeff was like, like I'm, I'm like <laughs> kind of panicking right now. <laughs> Jeff was like, why is Gwyneth just lying there? And then he went, oh, Jacob's painting her. <laughs> Hi, you guys. I don't know how that young love is working out. I'm Jojo. Yes. But F is on. Got it. <laughs> Pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> yeah, that was, that didn't need words. How's the game going? Fantastic, Jeff? you're winning. I've seen better. I've seen better <laughs> games. <laughs> you are. <laughs> but Does anybody need to get I have sheep for trade. <laughs> I, have, I have sheep to trade. Does that need a peeking at my cards? He's such a peeker. So I just stole the Ballinger's camera. I'm sorry, but we just, well, we're leaving now. And I wanted to thank them for having us. We had a great time. Did you have fun with the girls? I think they already know, but if you didn't know, are you married now? Oh uh, no. What? Are you sure? I'm there was a whole wedding. They had a wedding. There was a, a wedding. There, was, there was like four rehearsals and a real one. So it was pretty fantastic. So I guess they were being goofy, but it was, it, we had a really great time, and uh, these guys are great. That's all. Hi. Let's talk about what we learned today. We learned that it's hard for babies to take naps when there's a pokey adult in the room. We learned that nobody expects the armpit hair. And finally, we learned that Jessica Ballinger is the ruiner of food. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time. <laughs>